Did you know trees can talk to each other? Yes, you heard that correctly. Trees, like many other living organisms, have their own unique way of communicating. This might sound like a fairy tale, but it's a scientific fact. In the heart of our great forests, beneath the soil, there's a bustling underground network. It's not the internet, but something far more natural, the roots of plants. Through these roots, plants engage in a fascinating exchange of resources such as carbon, nitrogen, and other essential nutrients. Imagine two trees, a paper birch and a Douglas fir, their roots stretch out beneath the soil, intertwining and creating a complex subterranean web. But it's not just roots that are involved in this intricate network. There's another player in this game of underground telephone, fungi. Fungal mycelia, thread-like structures of fungi, act as bridges between the roots of different plants, creating what scientists call a common mycorrhizal network, or CMN. It's through this CMN that plants are able to communicate and transfer nutrients. In a recent study, researchers found that this communication is a two-way street. They discovered that carbon transfer between the paper birch and Douglas fir was bi-directional. Although the Douglas fir received a slight net gain in carbon, both trees benefited from this shared relationship. What's more, they found that carbon was transferred not just through the soil, but also through the CMN. When the hopeful linkages crossing the roots were severed, the transfer occurred, but at a much lesser rate. The real magic happened when the CMN was left unbroken. This study, and many others like it, confirm that plants indeed talk to each other through their roots and fungal networks. But this isn't just idle chatter. This underground tree talk plays a vital role in the adaptation of forest ecosystems. Plant behaviours such as root growth, shoot growth, photosynthetic rate and defence mechanisms can change rapidly in response to mycorrhizal colonisation. This means plants are not only communicating, but also actively responding to each other's needs. So, the next time you walk through a forest, remember, there's a whole world of conversation happening right under your feet. The trees around you are not standalone entities, but part of a larger interconnected community. They share, they communicate, and they adapt together. This is the remarkable story of plant communication. In conclusion, the roots, fungi, and nutrients are the unsung heroes of this narrative, facilitating a complex and crucial system of communication that ensures the survival and prosperity of our forests. Plant communication is not just a fascinating phenomenon. It's a testament to the intricate and beautiful interconnections of life on Earth. So let's appreciate the silent whispers of the trees and the vital role they play in maintaining the balance of our ecosystems. After all, without their secret conversations, the world as we know it would be a very different place.